we all know things are currently getting really hot as this year's world championships gets closer athletes from all over the world are putting the finishing touches to their training to come out on top because this is going to be a very challenging one for many athletes including our very own jamaican contenders the jamaican charles which start this weekend promises to be a mini world championships in every sense of the word the first reason being that it will be so competitive and lit that the entire world will be watching and secondly many of our favorite athletes sadly won't make it past the trial so in fact they'll have to treat it as their world championships now Johan Blake the former world champion will have to fight one of his greatest battles ever for a world championship any mistakes or poor execution of his race will see him missing a world championship spot which would not have happened unless he was badly injured Johan Blake will be up against the second fastest man this season. Oblique Seville, also Akeem Blake, his training partner, Kemar Bailey Cole, Christopher Taylor and a bunch of other guys who are hungry for a spot on the team. Usually this lineup would not have troubled Johan but he's not as young and as fast as he used to be so you never know what can happen. But it's going to take some effort for him to come out on top this time around. It would really be sad to not have Johan Blake represent us in the 100 meters this year at the World Championships. But he already has achieved a lot in his injury-free years and we still hail him as one of the greatest this world has ever seen.